Uh, hoi hoi everybody, it's Sasha here. How's everybody doing? I'm Sasha Bren. I'm the owner of Bren Scrubbers and we help business owners brand their best, scrub the rest. I'm here today because I wanted to talk to you a little bit uh, about one of my favorite concepts, which is reframing. Why? Because I believe truly and wholeheartedly that our perception is also our reality. And as our perception is something that is malleable, that makes our reality also malleable. So knowing how to reframe and understand one's environment and perception of the environment enables us to feel more in control of what we're doing. And the really cool part is that you can reframe almost anything from failure to fear. Uh, you can reframe how you deal with your family. Reframing is something that you can do on any level with any idea to further your advancement by changing your perspective. So for instance, uh, because we're talking about reframing today, I want to mention reframing failure because it's something that comes up a lot as business owners, right? Failure. I'm always so afraid to fail. Well, reframing is the reason that in my business, we don't fail. <laughs> it's actually not a concept that we use, right? We reframe failure to mean something completely different because in essence, you can only fail if you stop trying, right? So failure is really an absence of effort and we don't put in an absence of effort in our company. So we, we choose not to use words like failure because we don't fail, we just have to try again. It's just part of the process, it's another attempt. So allowing ourselves to reframe what we believe about failure changes how we perceive it, changes how we experience it, which shifts our perception and thereby our reality. So reframing is how as a business owner, you can take better control of your business and of the way that you perceive it and the way others perceive you. So I am actually going to be popping back. I'm going to talk more about reframing and, and I'm going to keep popping back with these amazing little wisdom bubbles because I'm in the process of finishing a book on reframing, one that I want to share with you. And leading up to this, I want to give you as many great tips as I can because I truly believe that if you can reframe your perception, you can build a life worth living. If you want to know more about building a life worth living, I actually do run a business group. Uh, we're called the Empowerment Pride Business Owners and Entrepreneurs who are looking to move their businesses forward through guided support, learning sessions, and of course, gratitude. So if you want to know more about these techniques and these things that I'll be talking about over the next several weeks, and you want to know more about them, come and check out the Empowerment Pride. Uh, these are the lessons I teach on a regular basis. You can also swing by the Facebook page, um, Empowerment Pride Facebook page, where I go live every weekday talking about gratitude and how you can use the attitude of gratitude, which in and of itself is reframing, to shift your perspective, right? Attitude of gratitude enables you to work more effectively, more productively, and that inevitably means more profit. So come check back in. I, I look forward to sharing more of these great reframing thoughts with you. And hey, if there is something that's, that's really causing you gumption, let me know. Maybe I can help you reframe it. I'm Sasha Brent. Come check me out. Brandscrubbers.com, empowermentpride.com. And hey, thanks so much, guys. You have a great day. Mm -hmm.